Hey everybody, it's Twiggy. I hope you guys are all doing well. Um, <coughs> let me turn on the light so you guys can see a smidgen better. Um, I wanted to film this really quick because the next couple days I'm going to be planting flowers on my deck and getting my flower garden ready for the season. Um, so I'm going to be like buying flowers and stuff like that. So I will be really busy doing that and getting dirty. Um, I may end up filming. I don't know. If you guys want to see how I plant everything or what I plant on my deck garden, um, let me know down below. I might film it or parts of it or do a tutorial of how I plant everything to make it look pretty and like my color scheme for this year. I think I did a lot of reds and purples this year again because um, it worked really well last year. So doing it again this year. Finally hunted down flowers. It was a disaster at work. Like normally I get them at, well, last year I bought them at work and I bought like a bunch because I got a discount and then like we had a bunch. So I was like, oh, I'll buy them all at work again this year. We have like none. Like we have the potted kind, which works for like, I need to get three of them because I put one in each corner of my deck, um, except for the one corner, um, that has my bird, um, bird feeder in. That one doesn't get one because otherwise the birds all toss bird seed in it and then I gotta pull weeds, um, out of the flower pots. So that one doesn't. And then the bird's poop kind of like kills it. So I do do that. Um, this is going to be, sorry for my rambling, a Starbucks cup haul, a Target haul, a Meyer haul, and a Walmart haul. I think, oh, and a Barnes and Nobles. It's kind of a hodgepodge. It's kind of like been piling up in my shower um, because I pull it, I put the boxes in there and then when I film, I just pull them all out and film. Or if I have to shower, I just basically put it this way. The reason I'm filming this today is I'm really tired of carrying all these freaking boxes out of my shower so I can shower um, like a normal human being without boxes everywhere. So I decided to take everything out. So without further ado, let's get into this. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe, hit the notification bell to be notified as soon as I upload a video. I will be doing a giveaway at 500 subscribers, and then I will be doing a larger giveaway at 1,000 subscribers. So it's going to be a, it's going to be like $50 gift card for 500 subscribers. Um, 1,000 subscribers, I'm giving a $100 gift card away. So without further ado, let's get into this. I will get into the boring stuff. Well, it's not boring to me, but boring to the people probably on this channel, unless you're into books. Um, I found these two books at, well, I found the other books at Barnes and Nobles and then they didn't have um, the like continuation of these. So I, I uh, had to order them because this is book one and this is book two. And I like to read my books in order if they're a series. I'm pretty sure I filmed my haul last week with the books I bought ahead of time. So I'm thinking I did that. I don't know. I have to watch my previous video. But this one's Joanne Ross. It's Heroine's Landing, um, a Honeymoon Harbor novel. This is book one in the series. And then this is the same author, same series. This is book two, and it's called Snowfall on Lighthouse Lane, and it's a uh, Honeymoon Harbor series. So those are the two books. I'm reading this one right now. I have to remember where I left off because I, in my haphazardly half asleepness last night, shut my book and forgot to like bookmark my page. So I gotta figure out where my, my page is. Okay, one of the items in this box, I don't remember if I hauled already. So I'm pretty sure it, I didn't and it just got here with my Walmart purchase. But I've hauled so much hygiene products lately, I don't remember anymore. So without further ado, let's get into this box. This is my Target haul. Um, I got, this one was, I think was from Walmart. I don't think this was a Target, but it might have been. Um, I got, everyone has been having this on their um, channel. It's the OGX um, Smoothing Coconut Coffee Scrub. I will admit, I really like this. And I don't like coconut um, by any means, but this smells really good. It smells super sweet. I end up smelling like a sugar cookie or like a really good yummy pastry. I have used some of it already. My cap is a little gooey, so I won't show you it, but it's a, it's really nice. It's not really a scrub to me. It says scrub, but it doesn't really exfoliate like a sugar scrub. Then because my freaking nail clippers keep growing legs and walking off and I don't know where the hell they go. 
Um, I bought myself a pair of nail clippers so I don't have talons for toes or um, claws for fingernails anymore. So, and then I also got another one of the vanilla cashmere EOS because you guys, this is so amazing. So I needed a backup of it because I don't ever want to run out of it because it smells amazing. Then I got, I wanted like a four pack of soaps because honestly I bought those other soaps, um, the oatmeal ones. I'm trying to smell this. I couldn't smell it before. Now I can't smell it. Here, let's smell. Let's smell a vision. Yeah, they smell good. This one is the Go Fresh Revive, and it is a beauty bar with pomegranate and lemon verbenum scent. I don't really smell the lemon, to be perfectly honest with you, but I kind of smell like the pomegranate. I don't know. I, in worst case scenario, if I don't really like this soap, I'm going to gift it to my grandma because my grandma always uses bar soap. I'm trying to, like, I don't know, find things I will like to use. Then, because I have so many scrubs, I got myself one of these uh, Eco Tools Clean Beauty uh, Clean Planic. It's a bath shower glove. Um, I figured I'd use it to, like, exfoliate because I am... Um, don't always like exfoliating with my loofah because then all the sugary grains get stuck in my loofah. I did get, write this down in the history book, I, wrote, I, I got female deodorant, which you guys know I don't usually buy, so. But I should have got the kind without aluminum in it. I think this has aluminum in it, um, which kind of sucks because I'm trying to stay away from aluminum. I'm trying to read... Yeah, it doesn't say aluminum free, so I don't know. But I got the dry spray. I want to see what this smells like, even though it's deodorant. Mmm, that smells good for deodorant. I don't usually like. I have not worn. I have not worn women's deodorant since like middle school. I've always worn men's deodorant or antiperspirant, and I really like the Harry's deodorant. It smells really good. Um, this is a dry spray, Go Fresh, and it's apple and white tea. It smells really good. And it's by Dove. And then I got Dove Advanced Care um, Moisture and it's Dry Spray Go Revive. Um, so yeah. Not a fan of this one. This one smells kind of like old lady-ish. But, you know, whatever. I'll just draw myself into my like Bath and Body Works sprays. Which right now, the spray for Bath & Body Works that I'm using is my summer go-to, which is the Hibiscus Guava Fresca. So I've been using that a lot lately. I smell like amazing. I do want to get the new stuff, but I don't know. I'm tossing the idea back and forth because right now the sales are so lame with Bath & Body Works. It's buy three, get one free. Like... What happened to buy three, get three free, or buy three, get two free? Um, and I'm on a budget, so... I mean, honestly, if I don't get it now, I might try to get it at SAS, and that would be the only thing I really get at SAS, except for some soaps that I'm looking for. Um, because this girl can never have too many soaps, even though I have a ridiculous amount of soaps. Um, but they make good Christmas gifts, and so my sister likes soap, so I get my sister a lot of soaps. Um, then I got these two items. I got the Ole Cleansing and Nourishing with B3 and plus Hyaluronic Acid Body Wash. It smells good. It's like perfumey. It's kind of bland, so it's good if you want to like use your EOS lotion on top of it so it doesn't have like a scent. Um, then I have the Ole Cleansing and Firming B3 plus Collagen Body Wash. So I got those two. I had a coupon. It was like buy two, save like four dollars or something like that. Um, some of this I have been using, so bear with me. I got the Maui Moisture Hair Care Color Protection plus C Minerals. It's the shampoo. It smells amazing. I love it. It's expensive as shit, but I love it. Then I got the Maui Moisture Hair Care Color Protection C plus C Minerals and the conditioner. So it smells yummy. I also got the um, Maui Moisture Hair Care Lightweight Hydration Plus Hibiscus Water Conditioner um, for my hair. And then this I was super excited to get. And this is the Whipped Body Cream in the Macadamia and Rice Milk 
one, I don't know why I love it so much. Because it doesn't really smell like a cook. I don't know. It's like a faint, like, sweet smell. And I really like that. So, um, super excited to have that. Because I have the body scrub. And I was excited to find out that it came in the body cream. Okay, so let's do the Starbucks. Um, I actually got these for my work, surprisingly. And surprisingly, we had a bunch. So I was, I was shocked. I got this of the new Starbucks cups. I got this one, which is like the studded cup, which I really love, these cups. My new obsession. I can't believe I paid $19.95 for it, but I got it. Then I also got this one, which is like the Mirabal one. They have a pink one. And like, I th honestly think if it was more like this color pink with like the dome lid, I would buy it. But it's like this really ugly, like peachy pink color, and I'm just not into it. I'm not a pink kind of girl, but this is really cute. I really like this one. And then I wasn't going to get these at all. Like, I was like, oh, I don't need them. Yeah, I totally bought them, and I really do like these cups, so I did buy these. I got the um, Color Change Confetti. I'm kind of disappointed this year that they didn't have, like, the full cups that change color, um, because I have those, and I love them, like, amazing color changing cups. But these are cute, too. Um, I just can't, like, I don't know. I like them. They'll be nice for around the house, or my iced coffees in the morning. So yeah, that completes my entire haul. It wasn't like that big of a haul. It was just literally, like I said, I just got tired of moving the shit out of my shower and I wanted to use these, but I didn't want to use them until I filmed this video. I do have the 50th anniversary of Starbucks cup coming. Um, I don't know when it'll arrive. I ordered it off Macari for a ridiculous amount of money. Not ridiculous. Ridiculous for me because I know it sells for like $19.95, so it's like 21 bucks. I got it for like 40 so basically I paid the price of two of the cups for this damn thing. Um, but I really, really wanted one because I really do love Starbucks and I love these cups. And it's something different to collect. So um, I hope you guys are all doing well and leave comments below and I love you all. See you soon. Bye.